Hi there, this is Paige with Stamp Girl here on YouTube and welcome to my channel. In this video I'm sharing with you my April cards for the 10 on the 10th collab. This is hosted by Kim who is Metal Scrap and Chick here on YouTube. And down below I'll leave a link to all the participants' um, channels in the description box. So for April I use quite a few Stampin' Up! products and a few other things as well. I used this paper and it is called Christmas Time is Here Specialty Designer Series Paper. And I used um, some of this pattern right here. Sorry for the glare, it's in the plastic sleeve that it comes in. I also used this pattern right here. And then I also used this paper right here. And I'm going to leave that out for a bit. I used some vellum from Stampin' Up. This is an older collection called Winter Wonderland Designer Vellum Stack. And it comes in several different patterns, some with gold print and then some with black print. And I used the gold print designs. I used some of this shimmer ribbon from Stampin' Up. It's really pretty and some gold glitter dots. Love these things. I used some of these gold sticker lines. I believe I purchased these from Elizabeth Craft Designs uh, quite a while ago. Love using those as accents on cards. I used some of this uh, sheer shimmer sparkle spritz. And I also used some of this Fun Stampers Journey gold silk that I just splattered on some of the cards. I used this stamp set, um, this one for the sentiment. I didn't use this stamp set, but I did use the die that cuts out that image. Let's see if I can line it up here. It cuts out that image when you stamp it, but it also cuts out image on the pattern paper. So I used this die on the pattern paper. And then the little um, image that doesn't match the die, I fussy cut several of those for some of my cards. And I think, oh and I also used this die right here. and I used it to cut some metallic paper for accents. So let's get that out of the way. Um, first I'll show the cards that I made um, using the dies. I've got a couple of each. So these are the dies that um, you can cut with the, or these are the images you can cut with the die. And then I cut it again with white, heavy white cardstock and just glued them together to make a sturdier um, embellishment. And then they're popped up with dimensionals. Here I use some nested dies from Stampin' Up! And here's that shimmer ribbon. On these two cards is where I use the Fun Stampers uh, silk and gold and before I did that on these two cards and these two cards I sprayed the card bases with this shimmer spritz. Um, here I made some little ribbon loops and let's see here's where I used that other die for some accents from gold cardstock and then these little Merry Christmas stickers I also bought a while ago from Elizabeth Craft Designs. And then on the inside of some of these cards are blank. Looks like all of these are blank. I need to add a white layer to the inside of those cards. Now my next set of cards is where I use the vellum. And this is where I fussy cut the image that doesn't match the die. And I just glued it down onto the vellum. And then 
some designer paper and here's where I used the gold sticker lines. And so I just used one pattern each of the vellum for each of these cards. And then on the insides of these I have gold metallic paper, white cardstock, and the stamp. May this Christmas fill your heart with warmth and love. So this month I um, got 11 cards uh, using that paper and all of these supplies. I'd like to thank you for joining me, and now I'm off to create.